Things are gonna go a little differently on the channel today. And in the future, I'm gonna review multiple products in this one video. So if things look a little different throughout the video and audio sounds a little here and there, apologies in advance. And thank you for dealing with that. I've had to take a bit of a break recently. You may not have noticed, you may not have cared. Do you ever feel like breaking down? But I needed to practice what I preached and administer a little bit of self-love. But don't worry. But don't what? I look like I've got pink eye. I look like I've got pink eye. Too much loving yourself. <laughs> but don't worry. None of this time's gone to waste. I've been training my endurance, my mind, my strength, my skills, my levels. <laughs> are gonna be a little different, gonna go for quality over quantity, and also, I just can't afford this <laughs> But that being said, welcome back to God in the Grass! I don't know if they just got bashed about or what. I think they fell apart in the tub, really, because I'm seeing a lot of stalk. They do look nice. Orange hairs are pretty tasty looking. Not super dense and crusty. They've got a little sponge to them, a little flake. Classic Aurora, very sugary, very bulbous, very good looking, quite light in color. Yeah, just very, very frosty. Super creamy, super, super creamy. You can definitely kind of smell like the gassiness to it. It's like a fruity cream, like a creamy fruit. It's a berry, it's definitely a berry. It's not like a citrus. Kind of smells like raspberries. Oh, mm. Mm. <coughs> oh, bit of pepperiness to it, but I like it. It's not over the powering, and you can definitely taste the cream. Berryness is not so much present, but the creamy gassiness of that is quite nice. <coughs> oh man, I ain't got any tropical. I do, I do. Yes, I don't. No. I mean, it's it's. Not <laughs> it's nice, but it's uh, it's a little cough inducing. But whoa. Through the tropical blast, you can still taste that. Nice amount of vapor. I mean, oh, it certainly gives the dry mouth. A little bit piney. Yeah, a little cushy. What? What? An OG Kush blueberry and sour diesel. I still don't feel like I felt a 31. I don't think it matters, honestly, but it doesn't feel any more powerful than your typical farm gases. It's not a heavy hitter. It's quite uplifting and quite energizing considering how this is quite cushy. I don't feel tired in the slightest, but I do feel quite mellowed. <coughs> Definitely giving me a bit of a dry mouth. Anxiety is being reduced. I will certainly say that. I'm getting a bit of a flush face feeling that I love. It's doing the job. I don't know why I said it like that again. <laughs> I'm really surprised I'm getting so much more vapor out of this. Okay, now it's tasting a little burnt. <laughs> that is effective for me. Oh, they smell like those foamy things. You know, the banana and shrimp stuff. Yeah, those. They're like creamy and you can smell that banana. It looks gorgeous. They are caked. They look like covered in sugar. They're not brittle. They're like a little bit, they're stick. They're definitely sticky and very powdery. They don't snap, but they do kind of have like a bit of a tear to them, like a snappy tear. It smells a tiny bit peppery. There's no like fruitiness or any kind of like grassy, piney, earthy tone. Just very sweet, creamy with a little bit of pepper at the end. They look quite nice. They're all like mid to smallish. What? I'm not getting much banana. What the fuck? There's like a little bit of like creaminess, a little bit of like vanilliness, and a little bit of menfoliness. Like a peppery menthol. But there's not much banana, considering how much it smelled like banana. Oh, okay, a bit better this time. I'll stick through my nose to get a good old whiff. You know what it reminds me of? Talimon, if you remember that, but just a little less spicy. There's like a little bit of taste, but it's subtle. For as much flack I gave it at the beginning, there is a lot of zebra. <laughs> yeah, it's just a little calming, but not like sedating. Headache is receding a little bit, not majorly, not like headache receding, headache receding, but like just a tiddly bit. Like it's creeping in a little bit, like that stillness. Cheeks are feeling a bit flush. Eh, to this, nah, to be fair, at this price, I'd expect a little better. Eh, I mean, it's withstanding the higher temperatures it's not awful it's not dry it's definitely a nighttime strand it just it's just a bit more of a looker than a fighter not much of a punch 
I love it. Mmm, <coughs> sweet, piney, certainly cushy. They're looking a bit closer to the buds I used to expect from Aurora. They're not huge, chunky boys. Very clear, visible orange hairs all over. They're looking good, good trim. They're not really very pungent. They just have like quite a sweet, piney aroma to them. They just smell a lot sweeter, a lot more cookies-like actually, to be fair. So it's not that they don't smell, it's just they don't smell of kush. Fuck yeah. Ooh, okay. It's got the cushier notes now. <laughs> yeah, that's the pepper. It's definitely got the pepperier notes. Oh, it's a little spicy. It's not super flavorful, but it is a bit spicy. <laughs> that reminded me of like proper salt and pepper chips for a sec then. It's not even gassy, it's just quite spicy. Ooh, the eyelids are feeling heavy. Wow, like my eyes just got super puffy all of a sudden. Maybe you are a cushion. Oh, that's making me sleepy. It's three o'clock in the afternoon. Oh, it's very nice. Oh, it's quite sedating. Oh, it's it's very calming. Calming. Not a lot for flavor. The, the effects are compensating for the fact that it's not a ton of flavor. For the fact that this has got some cookies in it and it smells quite sweet, you can't pick up on that. It's that it's just quite burnt. You get a lot of pepper out of that. I think there's a bit of pepper in there. Carry on filaline in the OG Kush. Carry on filaline in the wedding cake. Carry on filaline in the GMO. Really quite calming. It's really, really relaxing. Yeah. Oh, it's it's a Kush. This is some good sh it's good. It's making me a little bit upbeat, calming. It's certainly done the trick. It's certainly going to be a good night time. It feels good when you find a medicine that actually works. It kind of, this just makes me think of the blue milk from Star Wars. Big Nasty, if you please, coming back once again to satisfy my needs. Yeah, it's a little grapey, a little bit creamy. Not a lot of smell. Yeah, not a ton of stank. They are sugary, glittery, glistening, shining goodness. Different colors in there, light greens, dark greens, oranges, frosty all over. I haven't been majorly knocked off my feet in a while, and peach isn't the only one that I gotta say out of the bunch has really done that for me. And that's a contentious subject, I know. Hmm. It's very reminiscent of one of the other ones he did. I really don't know which one it was. If it was the gastropub, the glitter bomb. I think it was the gastropub. But it's got, oh, it's got a bit of taste to it. Is that, that's not a seed. <laughs> No, it's not a seed. <laughs> yeah, kind of, hmm. Deez, yeah, it's diesel Not a ton of flavor. I love staring into my globe. Whenever I stare into the globe and it like fills up with smoke, it just feels like I'm like Aragon taking on the Palantir. Are you aware of the power of shadows? Lock it in, chopper! That's really fucking to say, man. <laughs> 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 that is chemical. Mm. It's a coffer. Ooh, Nelly. Nelly Furtado. Like it's a little distracting. You could, go, you could go now. Thank you, Mr. Dusty. It's quite relaxing. The eyes are very heavy. Certainly uplifted. A little bit giggly. It's pretty effective. Like, I'm quite tired now. Very relaxing. Facial muscles, body muscles. I'm just in a relaxed state right now. Quite a punch. After you let it sit for a while, it sneaks up on you and kind of punches you in the back of the head. Giving me a little bit of a headache, the coughing. It, it's a bit too diesel -y for my taste. You might like that. Me, personally, it's a little too strong. Not unpleasant. It's definitely got a little flavor, but not much. Purple milk, a hard medicine to swallow, but certainly worth trying. Hope you've enjoyed today's video. I hope you've enjoyed seeing a number of different pros get reviewed all at once. I know, all in one video. So generous. Yeah, but if you like this type of content, uh, leave a like below and stuff. And uh, <laughs> let me know in the comments, I guess, uh, what you think and what you want to see in the future. I've got lots of ideas, just need the energy to get them done. As always, like I usually say at the end of these videos, love yourself, have a great day, and I'll see you next time. Yes, you motherfucker. Get the fuck in here, you oh, There we go, this is the chill content we want. Con N. Con N. Go on, turn around. No. All right, where you got? 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 No, don't you throw bombs at me. I don't get this one. I have dyslexia.